Hi there, I'm standing in the hallway uh, in my house. Uh, it's 7 o'clock in the evening. It's the 16th of December, I believe. And just to give you an idea uh, of what hiking and camping out in the woods looks like um, at this time of the year. I'll just open the door um, and we'll go outside. <clears throat> yes, that is the reality of uh, hiking, bushcrafting in Norway and similar um, latitudes at this time of the year. What you're seeing there are some lights from the um, neighbor's house. Uh, we are going this way. I'm still getting used to this night shot mode and I'm getting used to the camera. Um, it's a Sony FDR AX33, I believe, and I don't want to drop it. <laughs> Can't see much now. Um, around me, total darkness. Well, actually. That's some Christmas decorations on a nearby house. Uh, my son is waiting for me. I um, have to hurry up. So it seems like our friend Arthur has already started a fire. What could be nicer? Nå er du på film. Du er på film. Har du tent på all? Åh! Perfekt. Tente der. Ja, det blir veldig bra, altså. Blir det bra? Ja. Pappa? Ja. Tok du med Donald Kofferten nå? Donald Kofferten? Ja. Nei, jeg skal hente den til deg. Tusen takk. Hva heter det på polsk? Nazdrowie. Nazdrowie, ja. Cheers! Cheers. Men now, let's go to see no. Hi. He's saying hello. <clears throat> so we had uh, dinner. Um, just a few sausages, traditional Norwegian sausages. It seems like we always have to have sausages over the fire when we are out in the woods. So we decided to move inside and spend the night in the lavo. Uh, my son is here. He's already asleep. Uh, well, that's all for tonight. Um, it's 11 o'clock now and I'm getting uh, tired. My friend Arthur has decided to sleep outside, um, so I'll spend the night here, I'll sleep here, next, next to my son. Uh, so I'm in my, I'm in my sleeping bag now. This is my 
view. It's so nice to be able to lie down and feel the warmth from the fire. And also just hear the silence. Um, it's darker here than it looks on camera right now. It's actually like this. So that's all. That's all for now. Uh, I'll see you in the morning. My son is still sleeping. Uh, I discovered that I had brought not the winter sleeping bag, <laughs> so I was actually cold during the night uh, and I woke up with a headache. Um, now I'm just sitting here and I'm going to uh, make some porridge, I guess. Let's take a look at the uh, interior of the lava. <coughs> yeah. Now we haven't fixed the door yet. <coughs> Again, I've got the camera in night mode, so everything looks a lot lighter than it really is. Still, you get the idea. It's still pitch black. I believe it's about six o'clock in the morning. So that's it for now. We are heading back home. Uh, my son has a uh, bandy or hockey, I think it's called in English, um, match today. So it's actually only 8 o'clock in the morning now, but we have to head home. Um, so short trips like this one is actually they are nice too, you know, it's possible to get away even in the middle of a, a week. Uh, you can leave in the evening and uh, you uh, return before office hours to those 100,000 emails waiting for you. Uh, <laughs> I have to catch up with my son now. <clears throat> So that's all, all for now.
That's his flashlight there. I think I can safely say that 90% of this trip was done in total darkness. Um, so that's uh, that's different and it's a bit of a challenge. Even in uh, terrain that you know, uh, everything looks different. And especially now that they have uh, destroyed all all of this area, basically. They chopped down the forest. But anyway, that's all for now. I'll see you in the next video. Take care. Bye-bye.